to something else. You can't avoid it. It's going to be adding a chill to the air and making it a little bit harder to drive, especially on those north south roads with that crosswind coming in. We've got winds gusting around 30 35 miles per hour and it's making it feel a lot colder. So reach for the warm coats with wind chills now mainly in the 20s, at least below freezing across the state and the wind will stay strong and cold all throughout the afternoon. It's going to let up a little bit after sunset, but still a brisk wind continues overnight and notice those temps drop like a rock. Highs aren't going to be warm at all today, and then they'll turn much colder overnight tonight. So your feels like temp throughout the afternoon, only in the 20s and low 30s. Hopefully you sent the hats and the gloves with those kiddos for outdoor recess today. And tomorrow morning, whoa, it is going to feel like winter. Waking up to wind chills only in the teens on your Wednesday morning. Well, this midday, we're still stuck with the cloud cover, at least for central and northern Iowa. Southwest Iowa has seen that welcome sunshine. Now, as these clouds continue to kind of move off to the southeast, we have hopes of them breaking up and seeing at least a little bit of sun. At least it's not raining today. We're catching a nice break. There are a couple more systems just missing us. One was in Minnesota, kind of clipping extreme northeast Iowa. That's moved out. There's another one coming in from Kansas that's going to spread to the east and move across Missouri. That one, too, should also miss Iowa. But at the end of the week, we're going to get more cold air and another chance for precips. Let's take you hour by hour. This evening, very quiet weather. Still a little bit breezy, still a little bit cold, but the roads will be dry. No weather hazards out there today. And tomorrow looks pretty good, too. Mix of sun and clouds, not as windy, but it will still be very chilly. Then here it comes Thursday afternoon. We're going to see some light snow moving across at least the southern half of the state by the afternoon, clipping the metro area throughout the evening. That area of snow moves out, and a little bit more begins to move in as we head toward Friday. We could see some minor accumulations, too. It's not going to be a major storm by any means, but just kind of a taste of what's to come. Right now we're seeing some peaks of sunshine out there. Oh, it's chilly. 39 here in Des Moines, and it feels like 30 once you factor in that wind. So reach for those warmer layers today and keep them handy. Here's your eight-day forecast. The wind settles down a little bit overnight tonight. Tomorrow looks downright cold. Down into the 20s overnight, 40s maybe for highs. Then Thursday and Friday, we don't even make it out of the 30s and overnight lows will be in the 20s. It is way too cold for this time of year. Plus, we'll be seeing those snowflakes. For the weekend, it looks dry out there, although it looks very cold for the Cyclone game here on Saturday up in Ames. So lots of layers out there and get those little hand warmers and everything. Monday, a few more snowflakes are on the way and this cold air doesn't want to leave us. In fact, it wants to stay and get even worse. By Tuesday, highs could struggle to make it into the 30s.